So we are sitting in the Redwood Forest in Northern California right now. I've got my Tales of Adventure research I need to collect. We've got all of the Hisuian Growliths in there, which I don't have a perfect, I would love to have a perfect. Pretty sure that perfect CP is 566. But before we do that, y'all know what to do. We're gonna go to our Megas. Oh no, if it'll let us. We have pretty poor service. We're going to Mega one of these fire types. It looks like it will halfway load. Let's see how this goes. Whoa, look how cool this Mega Evolution is. They're just orbs. Got it. It is not a shiny, it is a 535. Okay, Hisuian Growlithe number two. Shiny or a hundo, hundo is 566. We are working with an insane glitch. What? They're not all Hisuian Growlithe? Oh, didn't know that. We got our third Growlithe thinking it's Hisuian. I would love a shiny just to dex it, no shiny. And 545, not quite what we want. Growlithe number four. It's a regular Growlithe. Okay, so that does check out. Making sense here. Our next one is Hisuian. Let's see. No shiny. 553. Okay, getting a little closer. Looks like he's wearing a wig. Regular Growlithe. I'm pretty sure 533 is the perfect for this one. So, nope, not quite. We've got two more of each. Next is Hisuian. No shiny. 556. Nope, not quite. Another regular Growlithe, 533 is the magic number, and no. Because I like to leave the best for last, I'm going to do the other regular Growlithe. Ooh, that one's pretty close, 529, not quite though. Final Hisuian from this research, I think we get another one at the end, but for this phase, no shiny, 534, okay. So we didn't get it yet, but we still have one more shot. We are staying optimistic. We have to collect this before tomorrow, so we are going to do it now. We get our two incubators, our one super, nice, and our extra encounter. So we want shiny or a 566, okay? No shiny. 531! All right, well, at least we got the candies. And you know what? These are tradable. These are pretty high-value trades, so grateful for what I got. We still need to finish this out to play timed research. The only thing we're missing, we haven't done a route. We need to do a route, walk a thousand meters traveling on routes, use an incense on a route, and catch 20 Pokemon. We've got one hour and 35 minutes to finish this out to play timed research. This route, I think, is 537 kilometers. So we'll just do this one forward and then reverse. So the first thing we need to do is we need to use an incense. I wonder if daily adventure incense works. Y'all think? Let's try that. Use an incense. It did. Okay, so we're doing our daily adventure incense. We need to catch 20 Pokemon while we walk this route. We'll go back and forth. So I've got my, I've got my master ball. It is so possible that we catch a Galarian bird while we do this. <gasps> and I was thinking, oh, it's raining, but it's not. It actually just finished raining. So. Everything smells so good. So, okay, I'll be back when I catch a Galarian bird. We got a big old Blizzy here, which is kind of exciting because we know that if it's a second Evo, then it gets one guaranteed XL. If it's a third Evo, we get two guaranteed XLs. So for example, let me, let me catch this real quick. Blizzy technically has two Evos, but Chansey counts as the first Evo. We don't count the babies, so Blissey is going to get a guaranteed 1XL. So in case y'all didn't know that, that's a fun fact. Always be catching those second and third Evos for the extra bonuses. And that was from our daily incense. We are gonna keep going. And so we are still, we gotta finish this route, walk 900 more meters and catch 16 more Pokemon. I clicked it really fast, but I did just get a Zygarde cell. So I think I was at six and now I am at seven. So yeah, we did just get a Zygarde cell, which is awesome. And we're about to finish this route, giving us about halfway for this distance we need. Yep, and then we need to catch two more Pokemon. So we're absolutely gonna get this done in time. Thank goodness, super stoked about it. And I think that it gives us a sweet Growlithe. And we still haven't gotten our perfect, so I am ready for it. Okay, we just need to catch two more Pokemon. We're gonna catch the Shelmet real quick. All right, didn't count. So we're gonna catch it again. And it ran. All right, so we're looking at this cute little palmy. It's not wanting to catch, so, okay, that ran also. Looks like we're gonna have to start using a berry. So we use a berry here. 
We use a great ball, which I am still pretty low on after calm day. It's so weird to me that all these are running. Weird, all right, well. Okay, we are going to finish the route. And to finish the route, you have to click the button and press complete route. Woohoo, completed. And we got a new badge because we've never done this route before. Thank you to those of you making routes. Real heroes. <laughs> it's gonna go back the way we came. We're reversing it and it's gonna give us the extra distance that we have remaining for this challenge. And I think we need to catch two more Pokemon and then we're done. No Galarian bird today, but that's okay. We got 14 Pokemon. I need to get my numbers up, it feels like, but we are about to complete this route and it actually didn't quite give us the distance we needed. So we'll do this route a little bit more. We'll reverse it again. Won't count, we won't complete it, but we'll do it. 917, I don't know, we're gonna be really close actually. We need a little more distance, so we're gonna go back. It's like I'm pacing this field, but we are so close. So close here, we need 69 meters. Here we go, 44. We're gonna make it happen. It's such a nice night though, I'm totally okay with this. Did y'all end up completing this out to play research? Because honestly, routes are not part of my daily gameplay and maybe they should be. Maybe this is my lesson. There it is. Oh, we did it. We did it. We get an incense. One, two, three, four, five thousand stardust. It's not quite enough for me to pop a star piece, but let's collect it. Ooh. And we get an incubator and a Pokemon encounter. And just a Hosui and Growlithe. 550. Nope. Not quite what I want, but that's okay. Again, it is trade bait. It looks like we did it. We completed our out to play research, which was our goal. We did our daily incense. I feel good. I feel good. I think I've got a bunch of 2Ks. These 2Ks are left over from the event. So there is still hope that we'll get the Hisui and Growlithe as a perfect. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I wanna know how your out to play event went. Did you get the shiny? Did you get a perfect? Did you like the event? I am not done raiding these legendary dogs. I do not have a perfect Entei. I do not have a perfect Suicune yet. And I don't have a shiny Raikou. So I'm gonna keep doing that. Let me know your thoughts on this event and I will see you in the next video. We've got a 2K8 hatching and this could be the shiny we've been waiting for. This could be the Hisuian, Growlithe, the shiny, the hundo. We could be hatching a shundo right now and that's why I'm recording. Here we go. Y'all ready to be a part of this moment? I'm so excited. It's so great. Um, I don't have a hundo with this one yet. Oh. Nope, no dice. We were hopeful. <laughs>